Hello friends, and that one person who doesn't like my Mega 65 videos. I'm um, going to try loading the ZX Uno core, uh, 48K, 128K Spectrum. So this is um, obviously the standard boot. I will now set the camera up and uh, let's try. Okay, so we hold down no scroll, power on. Well, after copying the core onto the uh, micro SD card, um, we want to edit one of the slots. So let's edit slot one. So control one. And it's had a look on the uh, micro SD. So I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what that second one is, but it's this one here. The R3 ZX Uno, whatever. Okay. Okay, so blah, 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 unknown, Mega 65 R3, core file is missing, model ID field, cannot confirm if the core file matches hardware. Are you sure you want a flash? Yeah, <laughs> nothing nothing ever bad has happened, has it? Okay. There we go. Pretty, pretty. Oh, yeah, so the ZX Uno core requires the VGA. Uh, it doesn't use HDMI. Um, that also means it needs to use um, the 3.5mm socket for audio, which I haven't got plugged in at the moment. So, okay. Da -da -da. Mm -hmm. Is this where I should be playing some uh, non-copyright background music? Okay, flash slot successfully updated. Press return. ZX Uno test one. Okay, so launch the core. I guess we press either one or we press return. Here we go. Press return. And up it comes. Tin. Ah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. This um, this isn't one of those patched ones. So delete is not that. Delete is oh, okay. Is the arrow key next to the one? Uh, da, 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 print. Hello or oh, hello. Close enough. Go to oh that's right. Yep. And then. Ah, uh, to run, scroll, there, okay, so that is um, 48k ZX Spectrum running, is it ZX Spectrum or is it the 80, ZX81, okay, I don't know what I did there, <laughs> I, I need to, uh, I need to read a bit more, stand by, okay, Power on again. Oh, okay. Sometimes I get gibberish. So if I just power this off again, power it back on again. Okay, I get gibberish. So if I leave it off for a bit longer, Power it back on again. Okay, there we go. So if I press escape, that's supposed to be the file manager. No. Hmm. Have I fully done everything? Go to, okay. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do,
SD card slot is currently supported. So there we go. So that's where you need to close the door. So that's where you need to copy XDOS and, and your software. So that's, uh, it's, it's a bit flaky by the looks of it. So turn it off and on. And yeah, we get that. So hold no, no scroll. Choose call one. Okay, and that's XDOS booting up. All very good. So there we go. So we press escape. There we go. And oops, also do do do. Okay, so I think some of this rubbish is because I've done this on a Mac. So these are probably dot the Mac rubbish. But we go into ZX. I've got Boulder Dash on here at the moment. No sound, obviously, because I've got the, I should really plug a speaker in. But um, this is one of the examples where it says that um, running at the original speed, it's pretty slow, three and a half megahertz. Um, let's see, um, EO7, I'll just wing it, shall I? Fire is NVBO, okay. Uh, shift lock, that's like a interface two. Now, what have I done? Oh, I should really plug a speaker in, shouldn't I? So this is running at the normal. Oh. <laughs> I really need to check this keyboard mapping. Okay, okay, escape going back into the Boulder Dash menu. Okay, okay, that was just space. All right, so if I want to use Sinclair, I press two, then I think I read that pressing shift lock means that the cursor keys will act as a uh, Sinclair Interface 2 joystick. Uh, let's see. Maybe. Space to pause. Five fuller. Oh man. I really know what I'm doing, don't I? Do, 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 do. Okay, let's, <laughs> okay, NBPO, NBPO, I'm going to have to have a look at the, uh, have a look at the instructions, stand by. Okay, I've learnt a bit more. Okay, oh, oh, what was the error? Okay, so, uh, XDOS, press escape. Uh, we go, there we go, we wanna to go to ZX, games, Boulder Dash. There we go, Boulder Dash. So, this will be running at three and a half megahertz, the, which was back in the day. Apparently it runs slow, um, but we can speed it up to seven megahertz. Now I did fiddle around trying to get it to play, but I couldn't figure it out. I need to do more research. So I'll just let the, um, the attract mode start. Actually, I might try. Okay, Sinclair, that's interface two, isn't it? Um, that's the, okay. So, now we turn on caps lock. That should mean we use the cursor keys and space. Okay. Maybe not. Press fire to play. 
Okay, okay, there we go. We just had to listen to that first, didn't we? Okay. Oh, yeah, using the cursor keys. So this is at three and a half, whoop, three and a half megahertz. Okay. So let's try. Uh, so escape goes back to the menu, but we don't want to load it. Um, can we reboot? This reset button doesn't work. So we have to power off, power back on. Okay. Oh, RTC.sys. Okay. There's an issue with that. Okay. So now if we type in ZX Games Boulder One dot tap. Okie dokie. Now out. We got to. We got to. Uh, that is holding down Shift Lock and O. No, that's Poke. Um, Mega and O. No. Semicolon. Control and O, shift and O, ah, there we go, shift and O, out, six, four, five, seven, one, eleven, okay, and what did I say, shift and out, no, so control, it was shift and out, wasn't it, there we go, okay, uh, six, four, eight, two, seven, 65. So there is a list of what equates to what uh, speed. I don't have it handy here. But this is supposed to be 7 megahertz instead of the standard 3.5. Okay. And now, not let. Extended. No, not user. Okay. Mm. Nope. What list? No. Ah, oh, there we go. J. Load. Oh, okay. Let's see. Sinclair. Caps lock on. Okay. <laughs> Can hear the music. Music's faster. Okay. Oh, much faster. Ah! <laughs> Way too fast for my brain. Okay, Doki. Okay. I used to play, I used to love this on the Amstrad. I probably played it on the CGA on the IBM as well. And then, whoa, there we go. Ah. And then, oh, the, that means the door has appeared. Cross. Finished. Cool. Okay. I'm getting the hang of this now. I'm getting the hang of this. Okay. I think think that's enough for now. I will try some other stuff later. Once I've uh, I'll try some 128k games, I think. And there's um, a whole bunch of ULA Plus software as well that you can download. So I'll give that a try out. Um, hope this was of some vague interest.